A spectacular sight as we gear up for the holiday. A warning from officials. Fireworks aren't the only thing heating up the night. With more triple-digit heat on the way, fire danger is top of mind. CBS 2's Lori Perez is live in East L.A. with more on what authorities want you to know. Lori. Well, Pat, we were standing about 50 feet away when L.A. County firefighters blew up a watermelon using a firecracker. We got pelted by chunks of watermelon like this. It's an annual demonstration to show the risk of using fire fireworks on your own, and they are urging homeowners to be careful. Now imagine, instead of a watermelon, it was your hand holding on to that firework. Last year, we had a nine-year-old Compton girl who lost her left hand and a few fingers, and a 17-year-old boy from the city of Long Beach who lost part of his right hand in fireworks-related incidents. It didn't take much to make mulch of the melon, and L.A. County firefighters say anyone who would risk using fireworks, illegal or not, should know they can be unpredictable and dangerous. Last summer, the city and county combined responded to thousands of fireworks-related injuries and fires. This year, because of already record heat, firefighters say you need to be extra careful to protect people and property. With us facing another hot summer, we are extremely concerned about the potential for brush fires, like the one we had yesterday in Santa Clarita. Fireworks, like pool parties, are a summertime treat. With both, staying safe is key. Even a, a, a fireworks, which was set off in a neighbor's yard, flew across the fence and into a, another child who was having a barbecue with her family and caused third degree burns to her legs. They're really asking people to instead enjoy fireworks at professional fireworks shows. A reminder that it is prohibited to use fireworks throughout the city of Los Angeles. Elsewhere, you should really check with your local fire department. Back to you.